Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Thank you guys so much for joining me today. So for my new viewers, welcome and my returning viewers, welcome back. My name is Jess. You can also find me on Instagram and on TikTok as Knit Plan Jess. Ah, today we are doing a dashboard plan with me. Um, so we have a few sticker books. I have funky abstracts, essential boxes and borders, and then the hand lettered basics. These are all new for the fall release. I don't know how much I'm really going to use this one um, on the initial plan, like decorating it, but um, I, I'm, I may kind of like keep this out and use it during the week. So we'll see. All right, so let's go ahead and go to my dashboard catch-all. I'm like I'm tearing the pages out, how it's not supposed to be te tearing out, torn out. We are doing the week of the 10th through the 16th. Happy freaking day. It is a three-day weekend, and I do not have to work on Monday. Oh, my gosh. Um, okay. So, I'm just, I don't know what that was. Okay, I will be able to use this for some things like the remember, the important. I have Vinny and Duke, I think, playing in a box in my my living room. So, hey. Okay, I think that I think that, that will come in come in handy. And I love, I love this hand lettered font. And I think that that'll be so fun to use. So funky abstracts. And then the stickers that I intend to use from this book. Um, so this has this does have silver in it. So what I am thinking is there are some silver, but these are like the holographic silver, but I think I still want to use them. And then we have a whole bunch of other foils. We have these, which I would think I would like to use. And we have these. I don't think I'm going to need those, but I, I, I can use these. I don't mind mixing like holographic silver with, or I guess hollow silver with regular silver. But let me share a story with you. It was such an ordeal to get this, this sticker book. So um, when I originally placed the order with Michaels, um, I, I ordered this sticker book and they sent me the retro budget, the bright retro budget, bright budget, whatever it's called. And I'm like thinking, this is not what I ordered. Why did you send this to me? Ooh, there's this foil too. That's okay. But yeah, so I, I sent them a message and they were like, sure. They were like, you know, we, we will send you the correct book. Um, you just have to send back the other one. Originally, I was kind of a little, you know, it's kind of lame that they messed up on what they sent me. And they want me to resend the book back, but okay, whatever. I don't care. I'm not going to fight about that. I'll do it. So they said, you know, we're going to send you a return label. And also keep an eye out for the, the order for the funky abstracts um, to kind of confirm it, whatever. So I'm like, okay, perfect. I'll do that. I never got, I never got any indication that Michaels was resending me the funky abstract. I only received an email about the return label. So I called the customer service this time and they're like, oh yeah, you know, you need, you will need to what was it she said? She's like, you will need to plan on mailing that back. And once we get it back, then we will create the order and send you the funky abstracts. And I'm like, wait, wait a minute. So I have to send back the incorrect book that you guys messed up on and sent me. And only then 
and once you once you get it back, then you will create the order for the correct book. Like that that just doesn't make sense. So she's like, well, yeah, that's just our policy. Blah 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 blah. Um, and I I kind of put up a fuss about it, and I don't normally do that, so I kind of felt a little guilty. But at the same time, it's like you know, if I had placed the order and I had ordered the retro budget wrong, I would have just gone to a store and been like, hey, I want to return this. Can I get, you know, and then just gone about that. But my thinking was, why, why are they only sending me the correct book only after I send back the incorrect book, which was not even my fault. So I put up a fuss, they send it, you know, and I happened to get this today. So I was like, well, thank you guys. Now I will rightfully send back the incorrect book because I said that I would, but it's just like, seriously, why do they make this so difficult? Why? Why? Okay. So anyways, what I'm doing is I'm using this box from the essential boxes boxes and borders. Um, I also took this chores and I'm using this, the, this, the plan sticker, but for the plan sticker, I want to put it down here, but I want to kind of decide, do I want any decoration? And if I want decoration, where do I want the decoration? So I think we're going to put this right here. I will be using the Mojo Jojo plans. Check it off. And I think I would like to put maybe decoration or a quote over here. Um, I don't think that this one has too many for decorations. It does have some, so that's at least something. Um, that's all like a rose gold. I think we're going to go back to here. Where were those clear quotes? Uh, so we've got those ones. I, I like these. What I really like is these. I want to kind of add something right here. And I think what I would like to do, for whatever reason, I am struggling with taking these stickers off of the page without it tearing the, the, the page. Okay, we're just going to put that right there. So in that way it goes over those two little dots that were left. Um, all right, quotes. Where did those, those quotes go? We're bringing in blue. Uh, expect nothing. Appreciate everything. And then let's just do black. Or do I want to do dark gray? I think I kind of like the dark gray instead. Um, and for this one, I'm going to take it like this. And then I'm just going to slightly trim it off and basically do the exact same thing. Actually, no, we're only going to do one checklist, but I do want to put a checklist down here. I don't know. I know that there's, that there's like little boxes right there that I can check it off, but I, I love my checklists. I love using them. So we're doing that as well. I like that. So checklists are in place. I think that's good. And then I think really the only other thing that I'm going to do for this one is maybe just kind of have like some decoration right there and then some decoration right there. Uh, I don't need anything major. Just, I don't know, just kind of bring in like some color yeah, for whatever reason. Um, I think tweezers are going to be a must for these sticker books. I'm also going to attempt to pick this up. Okay. 
<laughs> like, let me attempt to pick this up a little bit and see if I can cut away or um, lift it up and kind of put like the sticker so that I didn't have to cut it away, but that didn't exactly work. Guys, it has been a very long Friday. <laughs> It has been a very long week in general, which is one reason why I am so excited for my upcoming three-day weekend. If I was smart like my work friend, I would have taken today off, but I have too much to do, so it really wasn't reasonable. All right, let's maybe do this okay part of me actually wishes that i had put this on the other side all right let's see if we can pick this up i'm going to adjust this and we're going to put this right here and that still works i'm going to put this on my hand to remove the stickiness because i'm too lazy to go get wax paper um and i'm going to cut this away oops no snap I'm gonna cut this away <laughs> before I completely stick it down because I don't want to tear that sticker whatever we are leaving it there or else the sticker is gonna tear <laughs> I, I don't have a choice <laughs> um, let's put this right here and maybe like another one of these right there I feel like I need something else down here All right, that's kind of cute. I, I'm a very much so like a person who enjoys this kind of simplistic spread. So this right here is good. It still gives me a lot of functional space, but I feel like it is decorative. It is cute and it makes me happy and really makes me want to use my planner. All right, now we're gonna do this page. So this time, this one did not have, at least not that I remember, like this doesn't have any type of meals. However, I want to use this time off because this is technically a day off for me. Um, so let's go ahead and just kind of mark that. Celebrate the days off when you can. Am I right? Am I right? I also requested a week off, week of Thanksgiving, and I am so, so excited for it. Okay, no gold. Breakfast, brunch, lunch, dinner. Um, those were like dinner out. It wasn't necessarily like dinner plans. Well, not for what I need. Ooh, gro I like this grocery, but I, okay, the colors, the colors don't work. Meal plan. colors don't work is that okay do is it gonna look really weird if I have different colors in the spread I think that if I want to incorporate them right there I need to also incorporate them in this one as well so in that case, let's see what we can put in there. Um, my first thought is if I have a sticker that is like a plan, that says plan, not do. Although I do, I could use that do. Okay, I think we're going to actually bypass these this time. I will save this and I do want to use this um, for definitely an upcoming spread but I think it's going to have to be one that's a little bit more colorful because I don't know I'm I'm kind of a little weird when it comes to like adding color in to spreads that don't have a lot of color so instead we are going to use the one that says the plan and that will be kind of like my meal plan 
Um, I don't think that there's necessarily any other like boxes that I'm going to use in here. I think that just that large box. So that may be done. But now we have this one. Um, I love the idea of using this down here on Sunday. Brings in, I think, some really pretty color. Um, let's do this one on Tuesday and Tuesday is a day that I'm going to be working in the office so that's why I'm using this and I'm going to put this up here and then we're going to trim it across so in that way it looks like looks just like that I like that I love that design too I think it is so cute um, I need to make some plans for Monday like I want us to be able to do something because right now I really don't have any major plans I am going to put a box on Friday. I'd like to put in boxes on days that we actually have, like I kind of have something that I need to highlight, that, that I need to highlight. So um, like maybe it's something that I have to make sure that I do that day or, or plans for my son. Uh, but that way I can just make sure that it is highlighted and I do not forget about it. You know, some of these stickers remind me of the uh, minimalist. And that makes me kind of want to use that sticker book again. So I should do that. Um, okay, let's use one of these. We're going to do that. And scissors. I don't mind trimming down stickers. I really don't. Oh, I did not even see these. There's a long weekend. That's fantastic. We're going to put this right here because like if I had this book, um, when I went to decorate the previous week, I think that that would have been a good sticker to use, but that's okay. Also, I kind of want to use one of these elsewhere. So there's this one that says, do something that makes you feel, do something that makes you feel fully alive. I really like the idea of putting that right there. I don't know why I was about to put that sticker book away. Okay, anything else? I think really the only other things that I want to use is going to be like dots. And for that, we are going to use the Mojo Jojo plans. That is so crooked. We're going to use the Mojo Jojo plans check it off book. Um, for the circles. So let's just go with the dark gray. And I think for this, we are going to do two a day. I think two a day sounds good. Because in that way, it gives me plenty of space to kind of write down what I need and then during the week if I happen to need um, like maybe I need to maybe there's something that comes up that I need to highlight I can always pull another um, another box sticker and put it on there like Friday I'm only gonna do one though just because I've got that box right there Sunday's gonna get nothing and then Saturday and Thursday are going to get two each. Oops. 
Oh my goodness, you guys. <laughs> okay, there we go. See, super simple, but I like it because it's like colorful. I feel like I need a quote on this page. The problem is, is that I don't think that there's any like smaller quotes that would work. <laughs> How about this one? Dream, create, inspire. I like that. All right, super simple spread, but I really, oops, I really, really like it. So there we go. I like it. I like the overall spread. I have plenty of room for function. To me, it is perfectly decorative because I don't like the ones that are like super, super busy in terms of the decorations. Um, it just, it, to, it feels very overwhelming to me sometimes. So this is exactly what I like. And again, I used Funky Abstract and then a couple stickers from the Essential Boxes and Borders. Both of these are brand new for the fall release. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you like it, give it a thumbs up. Don't forget to hit that subscribe button. Thank you guys so much for all your support and I hope you have a good day. Bye. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to subscribe and enjoy the next video.